Welcome to Cheap Cheese. We're your ultimate guide to the flavorful world of affordable delicacies. As fellow food enthusiasts, our mission is to unravel the secrets behind the price tags of your favorite treats. Today we're taking a twisty turn down the instant ramen aisle, a beloved staple consumed by millions around the globe. Our quest to explore the wide chasm between the cheapest and the most expensive instant ramen and discover what exactly makes them so different. So buckle up as we dive into the savory and surprising world of instant ramen. Did you know that an estimated 103.6 billion servings of instant ramen are consumed worldwide every year? That's a whole lot of slurping. Instant ramen, that quick, convenient, and pocket-friendly meal, has found its way into kitchens and hearts across the globe. Let's dive into the noodle bowl and explore the top consumers. China, known for its rich noodle culture, leads the pack, followed closely by Indonesia, a country where instant ramen has become a staple comfort food. And then, there's India, with its burgeoning population and its love for quick spicy meals, making it a major player in the instant ramen market. These countries combined consume billions of servings of instant ramen annually. That's like every person in these countries having their own personal noodle feast almost every other day, and that's a lot of noodles isn't it? Now let's talk about where these noodles come from. In the bustling markets of Nigeria, you can find the cheapest instant ramen in the world, costing just 20 cents per pack. Now you might be wondering, how can something so satisfying be so affordable? The secret lies in mass production and the use of inexpensive ingredients. In the world of instant ramen, Nigeria is a heavyweight champion, producing millions of packets each day. These factories are a marvel of efficiency, churning out ramen at a dizzying pace. The noodles are fast cooked, then rapidly cooled and dried before they're packed with their flavor packets. The ingredients too play a role in keeping costs down. The noodles are made of wheat flour, water, and salt, while the flavor packets contain simple spices and dehydrated vegetables. You won't find any truffles or wagyu beef here, but you will find a meal that's quick, tasty, and kind to your wallet. But it's not just about the cost of ingredients or the efficiency of production. It's also about scale. The sheer volume of ramen produced in Nigeria drives down the cost per packet, making it possible to sell ramen for just 20 cents and still turn a profit. So as you tuck into your next bowl of instant ramen, remember that behind its humble price tag lies a story of efficiency, scale, and simple ingredients working together to deliver a meal that's affordable for everyone. But what happens when we move from the affordable lanes of Nigeria to the premium aisles of Japan? In the heart of Japan, the most expensive instant ramen retails for a whopping 12 US dollars per pack. Now let's take a moment to digest that. 12 dollars for instant ramen? Yes, you heard it right. This isn't your ordinary late-night college dorm room snack, it's a culinary experience that takes the humble instant noodle to a whole new level. What sets this luxury instant ramen apart is the quality and uniqueness of its ingredients. Forget about the usual powdered soup base and freeze-dried vegetables. This ramen is a gourmet delight, boasting ingredients such as dried shiitake mushrooms, seaweed, and even bona fide pieces of dehydrated pork. All these are sourced from local producers, ensuring the freshest, highest quality ingredients. But the truly unique feature of this high-end ramen is the soup base. It's made from a blend of three different types of miso, fermented soybean paste, a staple of Japanese cuisine. Each type of miso is fermented for a different length of time creating a complex flavor profile that's both savory and slightly sweet. And then there's the preparation method. This isn't just a case of add boiling water and wait 3 minutes. The noodles are par-cooked, then air-dried which gives them a distinctive texture. The soup base and toppings are added separately, allowing you to customize your bowl to your taste. It's a far cry from the one-size-fits-all approach of cheaper instant ramen. Even the packaging of this luxury ramen screams quality. The noodles come in a sturdy resealable bag with separate sachets for the soup base and toppings. The packaging is also beautifully designed with traditional Japanese motifs and calligraphy, making it a perfect gift. So when you're paying $12 for a pack of instant ramen, you're not just buying a quick meal. You're investing in a unique gastronomic experience that blends tradition, innovation, and premium ingredients. And you're supporting local producers who are passionate about their craft. So, we have two very different products but what makes them so different in pricing? Let's delve into that in the next scene. The price difference between the cheapest and the most expensive instant ramen is staggering but why is that? Now let's delve into the factors that contribute to this difference. First off, let's talk about ingredients. 
The cheapest ramen usually uses low-cost ingredients such as refined wheat flour for the noodles, and simple seasonings like salt, monosodium glutamate, and synthetic flavors for the broth. On the other hand, the most expensive ramen will often employ high-quality ingredients. Imagine gourmet noodles made from premium wheat, broth packets filled with exotic spices, dehydrated vegetables, and even bits of real meat or seafood. It's like the difference between a simple sketch and a detailed painting. Packaging is another factor. Those 10-cent ramen packs come in a simple plastic wrapper, while the pricier options might be housed in a stylish, sturdy box, replete with eye-catching graphics and detailed cooking instructions. It's not just about protecting the contents, it's about the experience. Next up, production methods. Mass-produced ramen is made in huge factories with machines doing most of the work. This keeps costs down. But the pricier ramen might be made in smaller batches, with more human involvement and attention to detail. Some even use traditional noodle-making methods which can be labor-intensive and time-consuming. It's a matter of quantity versus quality. Finally, there's the power of branding. A well-known brand can command a higher price for its products because people trust in the quality and consistency they offer. Plus, the most expensive ramen often positions itself as a luxury product, and that perception can justify a higher price tag. So while you might be able to buy a pack of ramen for less than the cost of a candy bar in some places, in others, that same pack could cost you as much as a decent lunch at a sit-down restaurant. Indeed, a world of difference lies between a 20-cent ramen and a $12 one. But who's buying these expensive noodles? While cheap instant ramen is a global phenomenon, the expensive ramen has its own niche market. Who are these people willing to fork over top dollar for instant ramen? Well, the answer might surprise you. The priciest instant ramen isn't just for the rich and famous. It's for anyone who appreciates the finer things in life. And yes, that includes ramen. Countries like the United States, Canada, and parts of Europe, where food culture is increasingly being seen as a form of self-expression, are the biggest consumers of expensive instant ramen. These are places where people are willing to pay a premium for quality and unique experiences. The same mindset that gets people to line up for hours for artisanal cheese or craft beer drives them to splurge on gourmet instant ramen. Japan, the birthplace of ramen, also has a significant market for upscale instant ramen. Here, ramen isn't just a quick meal, it's an art form. And while nothing can replace the experience of sitting in a ramen shop slurping up a bowl of freshly made ramen, a high-quality instant version is the next best thing. And let's not forget the foodies who are always on the hunt for the next big thing. They're drawn to expensive instant ramen because it's a novel, fun way to experience a beloved dish. So, whether it's a quick budget meal or a gourmet experience, instant ramen has something for everyone. From the bustling markets of Nigeria to the gourmet stores of Japan, we've taken quite a journey today. We've explored the vast world of instant ramen, a dish that unifies foodies from all corners of the globe. We learned about the surprising volume of instant ramen that's consumed every year. The staggering numbers that prove our collective love for this quick and easy meal. We discovered that the top countries consuming instant ramen are not always the ones you'd expect, with Nigeria and Indonesia leading the pack. We dove into the realm of the cheapest instant ramen, originating from the vibrant markets of Nigeria, where a pack of instant noodles costs less than half a dollar. We contrasted this with the luxurious most expensive instant ramen from Japan, where a single pack can cost as much as some of the cheapest coffee beans. We discussed the reasons behind this vast price difference, from the quality of ingredients to the manufacturing process, and how these factors contribute to the final price tag. We found out that the countries consuming these expensive instant ramen are often the ones with a strong food culture and a willingness to pay for quality. So whether you're a fan of the budget-friendly Nigerian noodles or the high-end Japanese ramen, one thing's for sure. There's a world of flavors to explore in the realm of instant ramen. Don't forget to subscribe to Cheap Cheese for more fascinating food facts. Until next time, keep exploring the world of flavors without breaking your bank.